Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I am in Walt Disney World right now. I have just flown in for the annual Epcot Disney pin training event. Today is the first day. It's not really even the first day. It's just pre-registration day. But I kind of wanted to make a video taking you with like the whole process of the big Epcot annual pin event. So I'm gonna start today with registration and then I'm gonna take you to the event tomorrow and Saturday and kind of show you the ropes. This has been a highly requested video. Um, the theme of this year's event is Disney Disney fairy tales, so it's all Disney animals. I'm rocking my Oliver and Company t-shirt today, and I've got a couple like little mini Disney bounds for the event itself. So I'm super excited. Right now, I am at Disney's Coronado Springs Resort. I'm actually at the new Grand Destino Tower. I'm meeting up with my friend Ryan from Disney Pins Blog, and we are gonna go pick up our event merch. We're gonna go get our pins. So I'm taking you with us, and here we go. Pin time. Okay, I just met up with my best pin buddy. It's Ryan. Back at it again. <laughs> Back at it again from Disney Pins Vlog. Yeah. Ryan showed me the ropes at this event last year. Yeah, so we now did the I whole feel, Yeah, we did. Now I feel like an old pro. And we're meeting up now to go pick up our pins. So yep. we are RSP headed to the, uh, yeah, the RSP pickup. And where are we? The Coronado Springs Convention, Convention Center. Center yep. Yeah, so here we go. Excited. It's Ryan. I'm so happy. Hey. <laughs> so there is the sign for the pickup. It says... Vera Cruz Hall A, registration and pickup, and then there's also pin trading in Vera Cruz B. We're not going pin trading, we're just gonna pick up. All right, here it is, the longest line in the world for pin pickup. Okay. It does get calmer um, as the day goes on, but we wanna get our stuff, so. Yeah, we got, we've got our work cut out for us, just hanging out in this line here. Good thing we've got lots of catching up to do. Okay, right. It's 11.09 a.m. Yeah, it's bad. <laughs> How long do you think it's going to take us to get At least an hour. At least an hour. Because this, this line's insane. I'm saying 90 minutes. 90? I bet, yeah. We're saying we're going to have a little contest. Why can't we be best in show? We're the mutts. <laughs> we're the flea-ridden mutt, mutt yeah. crew here. All right, so we are pretty much made it to the front of the line now. Um, how long do you think we've been waiting in this long line for pins? How long do you, how long do you think? Too long. Two and a half hours. Yep. 2.5 hours. What well, we do for the pins. <laughs> Sacrifice ourselves for Disney pins. And like a thousand other people are doing this too. Yeah. And the line's staying consistent too. So even if you got in line right now, we yeah. should be waiting three hours. It's insane. There's Ryan picking up his merch, signing off on all the goods. And uh, here's mine. This is my, my bag full of goodies. There will be probably a separate video haul coming with some of these, but I got my stuff. And this is what's happening in the uh, ballroom across from the long line. People are already out doing their pin trading. So uh, they're very hardcore. They're already doing it, even though there's three more days of pin trading ahead. What'd you get, Ryan? Got the merch. He the got the merch. New, uh, Elfman, I heart gaming pants. Oh yeah, so lenticular element. Yeah, these hey. just came out today, so yep. it's all LA, happening. LA 1500. <laughs> All right, so we did it. We got the merch. It took forever. <laughs> um, and that's kind of it for day one of the pin trading event. It's just pre-registration. Some people do a little trading. You pick up your pins. I think I will give you um, at my hotel a quick overview of what I purchased. And then I'll see you tomorrow for day one of the actual fairy tales pin trading event. All right, I am back in my hotel room. And I just want to real quick give you a quick... Uh, overview of the pins that I purchased that are being released at the Fairy Tales event. I ordered these ahead of time. That's kind of how you have to do it. You fill out a little um, random selection process form and hopefully you get what you're looking for. I will do a more formal haul of this um, in a different video, but I've got a couple of um, the event pins here. Um, I got Todd and Copper and Elliot the Dragon. This is one of my favorite ones. It's like a, an Aristocats mini jumbo pin i know a lot of people that wanted to get this one weren't able to get it but i got super lucky uh one of my favorites from the event is the figaro and cleo goldfish bowl this is the pass holder pin so you got walt disney and, and dog photo uh, and then the frame around it is gold and it's got different animals on it got a really cool nana pin i collect nana pins and then i've got um seven of the mystery pin boxes from the event. I'm gonna be doing a separate unboxing video with my friend Ryan um, of these. I'm pretty sure that's gonna already be posted by the time I get this up, so I will link to the unboxing video of the mystery pins down below. Then I got this box set, um, and this has 
some of the animals from the Disney Parks attractions. And then finally, I picked up the event exclusive Magic Band. This is pretty slick looking. It's got uh, some Disney animals on it. And get it out here. So we have the event logo and then there's Pluto and Figaro and then of course we have um, Cleo, Iago and also Pascal and Pua. And then also when you register you get kind of a welcome packet that includes your event credentials and you get little um, pin trading tabs for both Friday and Saturday for the cast member pin trading boards. More on that later in this video. Um, it kind of gives you an inventory of all the pin releases and I think there's the pin artist information on the back. This card here is for a fun scavenger hunt activity and when you complete this you get um, you get pins for prizes which is super cool. And then um, this is the uh, welcome pin so everybody gets this as kind of a gift. It's the Disney Fairy Tales 2019 logo featuring Figaro and Pluto. You get a $25 gift card and then also a little um, table tent for back in the pin trading area. There are also a few other event pins that are not in my current stash that my friend Dana got on her RSP on my behalf. So I got um, the Oliver and Company pin and also another box set and I will show those to you in the actual official Fairy Tales pin haul. Um, but that's good enough for now and next time I see you it's going to be pin event time so see ya, see ya tomorrow but still on this video like tomorrow but also today. Good morning, it's the big day. It's pin event day. My camera is fogging because it's really humid outside and look who I just met up with. Yeah, Godfather <laughs> Pins is here. <laughs> he's got his copy and he's got this cool shirt. Yeah, new drop just today. Yeah. I'm just here for the pins. We're just here for the pins. Um, yeah, so we just left the hotel, the Dolphin, which is where we're both staying because it's very convenient for the pin event to stay yeah, in that great. Epcot resort area. And we're on the boardwalk and we're walking over to the World Showcase entrance. And then we will wait. We will sit outside and wait for the uh, convention center to open, yeah, which opens at 9.30. Yeah, like an hour or so. Not too bad, but it's really muggy and humid. We've got our little um, fairy tales credentials and I'll show you what it looks like inside. It will be less humid and foggy yeah. than this, but it's pin, pin event day, Super Bowl of pins. Let's go get those APs. Yes. All right, we've just made it to the uh, World Showcase entrance, and this is the security line, and there are many people with suitcases full of uh, pins. So that's pretty exciting. And then there's the Skyliner. I'm so excited to ride that. There's Ryan Deere, he's vlogging. <laughs> We've made it into the park. We are in Epcot. We're in the World Ooh. Showcase. The uh, convention center is located in the UK Pavilion. And we're just coming up on the line to get in right now. So far, it doesn't look too bad, but we'll get a better look when we get closer. <gasps> They're doing a wedding shoot. Did you see that? It's the most magical place on earth, everybody. That's good. And pins. Oh, baby. We've been waiting in line for about an hour. We are. All of us are just like soaked through our t-shirts with sweat. It's almost time to go in, probably in like two minutes, so that's good, but I have new new friends around. Sarah Beth is here. She brought me the cutest puppy dog. I'll show you it later. Look at Ryan's sweaty t-shirt. Very sweaty. Johnny's here, Johnny Boy is here. So yes, people are people are trading in line and everyone's being super friendly and everyone's being a good sport because it's really 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 hot and humid so hopefully we'll go in soon okay here we go we are going in are you guys excited yes are we excited yes so excited you're hot so best thing so far is air conditioning i mean it looks beautiful but air conditioning is the most beautiful part of all of it here we are so we're heading into the event center for the first time it's very beautifully decorated with animal type things we're trucking toward the trading boards. That one or this one? It's the board. The board. The board. That's the game. Let's go to this one. The board. Uh, Hello. Good morning. Good morning. So basically, what you do is you get in line, long lines, and you wait all day long to trade for special pins on a cast member board. And you hang out with your friends, and you talk about pin stuff, and then some people trade pins, and then it's just pins all the time, and it's really exciting. 
But the thing about the trading boards is when you get up there, they time you. So there's like all these pins to look at, but you only have 60 seconds. Is that true? Yeah, 60 seconds. You get 60 seconds and they time. time you. And you were like looking and your eyes are going cross-eyed because you're like, which one do I want? And yeah, you freak out. Plot. And then you pick something out Try and then it's out. a rush. It's a rush. So I'll show you in a minute. After we wait in line for an hour, then I'll show you. Okay, it's lunch break time. Brian and I have a tradition. This is our, the second year of our tradition. But on the first day of the event, we get fish and chips mm -hmm. at the Rosen Crown for lunch. So, look at that fish and chips. And I also got a beer, and Ryan got the same. How's the event going for you so far? Good, busy. I think it's more crowded than last year. I think so too. We made good trades. Two so far. We used two two of our tabs. Yep. So we got four pins each. Yeah, I'll have to get a close up of the actual uh, trading trading uh, process, but yeah, yeah. Okay. So far, so good. These are the four that I've pulled off the board so far. So they're all AP, and then these three are all limited edition. I like the Simba though. I'm kind of on a Lion King kick, and I also like this Mary Poppins fine and dandy. So not too shabby. I'll have to show a close-up of the trading process though. It's pretty wild. No, she's at my friend's. Okay, this is legit the most fearless Disney yeah. duck I have ever met. It just but snatched a fish out of my hand. And then I touched its beak with my event card and it didn't even flinch. You are a bold feathered friend. Oh, there he goes. Bye. Bye. Hashtag Disney ducks. He's just He's over it. Here. All right, after it got to be like 1 p.m., I left the pin event. It's just, it's really fun in there, but it's like, it's like a high concentration of stimulus all at once. There's like stuff happening on the loudspeaker and lots of conversations happening and lots of pins happening. So I needed to go back to my room and take a break. I, I took a shower and I stared at the wall for a while. Um, and now I'm headed back into Epcot. I'm gonna meet up with my friend Corey. You might know him as Corey Fiasco. I'm not getting to spend a lot of time with him this trip, but I do have some pins that I wanna give him. And they're actually the, the pin set that they gave out as the scavenger hunt prize, prize, at the pin event. So I wanna show you those because I'm about to give them away and I won't be able to vlog them or put them in a haul later. So I'll show you those in just a second. Right now I'm outside of the dolphin and I'm just heading back over to Epcot. Okay, so this is Corey and Haley. Hey guys. <laughs> you may hey. have seen them before. And this is the, uh, the pin set that I'm handing off to them since I won't be able to show it in my haul at home. But it's six Pascals. This was the, um, this was the prize for the Pascal's scavenger hunt for the event today. And I'm gonna be super honest and tell you that I did not complete the scavenger hunt. I just handed them my tab for it <laughs> because I was so exhausted. Um, but it is a nice set. So there's six pins and it's LE 1200 or whatever, however many people are at the event. Now you've seen it and now I'm handing it off. What can I give you for this? You can give me something later in life. Okay. I'm not keeping score. Thank you so much, Yeah, Becca. you're so Now it's like I went to the so, event. It's like you were I there, didn't. but you didn't. I didn't go. Yeah, but I thought, when I saw that, I was like, oh, I'm gonna give that to like, Corey and Haley. Yeah, I, I gave them that so they would say <laughs> nice things about me on my own video. Good morning, it's day two of the pin event. Official day two, and I have a new pin buddy. Yvette's pin here, buddy. yes. So Ryan has slept in. He'll be by later, I'm sure. But now I got a we new roomie. Him. We did, we new pin buddy, Yvette. She's, she's, this is gonna be her first day. First time at a pin event. There's only one first time, as I like to say. And uh, we're gonna do a little bit of trading on the boards and yeah. Check out the pin previews and mingle around and stand in air conditioning. Stand in air conditioning because it's extremely hot out. It's very spicy out. I got my uh, Figaro ears on this morning, and this lady has life is rough. Life is rough. Disney dog shirt. So cute. <laughs> Big nerds going to the pin event. <laughs> By the way, this is the line to get into the pin event for day two. We're just getting here right as it opens, so we're much farther back than before. Everybody's gonna go in there and wait in line. Everyone's waiting in line to wait in line, basically. All right, here we go, the mad rush in for day two. Everybody's got their, their bags and bags of pins. Everybody's running off to make some trades. Everybody's booking it back to the lines. It's a wild and crazy ride this morning. This is Chelsea. She collects Disney dogs. Uh -huh. This is some of the stuff that she got on the boards yesterday. Yes. Did you pull that 
Fox and Hound? No, I actually traded with someone for it. Oh yeah, I have that one. Yeah. Mm -hmm. it's a I good got one. all of those yesterday. Oh, I love those Mickey ones from uh, the pop-up. Nice. So, but what you do online is you just talk to people about pins for however long it takes. You just talk about pins and you show off your pins. People trade their pins. And this is all pins all the time. Best day ever. Best day ever. One other thing that is happening to keep people entertained in line is there's Disney trivia happening. So you probably can't see, but there's a woman dressed as a cat. There she is. Asking trivia questions. And if you win, you win like really nice pins. I mean, I didn't sign up for it, so I didn't, but it's a thing that you can do. Okay, so here is a look at the actual trading game. This is the little pin boxes. They time you for a minute. You get to pick two pins that you trade for your cheap pins, and you get to keep whatever's inside. And it's pretty fun, especially if you get good pins. So you can either do like these little games, a uh, little pick the box that you want game, or they also have like this huge cast member boards, and they time you for a minute, and you've got a lot more to choose from. These tend to be a bit more popular. Also, look at this small world, pets world background that they did. It's gorgeous. I wonder what they do with this, by the way when it's over. I would buy that for my yard. <laughs> okay, it looks like they are refreshing the boards, so that's very good luck since we're getting close to the front of the line. We've been in line for about an hour. Yes, they are changing out the boards. Yes. Right, we're in the front of the line. Are you excited? Vlogception? Okay, so even though they refreshed the boards right when we got up there, I didn't get anything too awesome, um, but now we're in another line for the little mini boxes, and the set is so cute. It's all French, and can you see them? It's Aristocats, it's so, so cute. And over there, you've got a lady in the tramp set. They really did make it look nice in here. I, I love the, the pets. Disney Pets decoration. My first pin event, what do you think so far? I think it's really fun. You're having fun? Yeah, standing in line not so much, but getting there is fun. Uh, it's fun, yeah. We're on a break from the pin event. We came to France for a break. And we got some refreshing beverages. Yvette always gets the orange slushy every time she comes. It's tradition, can't break tradition. And I'm trying the lemon one, and it's very nice. Up there, there is a mime on a ladder. And he's pretty much always here, so it's not that exciting, but it's still fun. He's got a whistle, he's blowing it a lot. We're having a little bit of lunch back in France. We got some croissants with some ham and cheese. They're really good. Yvette got the lobster bisque. In the heat. Yep, second time in, in uh, 24 hours for lobster bisque. I won't tell anyone, don't worry. There he is, the godfather yeah. of pins. How's your day going? Good, good you, stuff in today. You just loving life. Haven't done any tabs yet. Yeah, it's okay. Yeah, <laughs> scrolled in the event for a little bit. It's yeah. Good buy set, which is very nice. From, we're pin lunching with friends and we're comparing pin, pin size. I win for the jumbo. I just yeah, bought that. Do. But I have a big one at home, so. We're eating back in France now. <laughs> Using your credentials as a fan. It's very. So you, hey, take it out, baby. Wow. Ryan's here that. doing his yeah, huge paw print. Doing with the work. Various Disney characters in Figaro, Elliot, Pluto, Sven. Wow. That is a beast of a pin. One of my favorite new pin friends is John. Johnny Boy. Sometimes he going? comments on my YouTube. We met last year. We did. But I feel like we, we kind of bonded this year. We did. We did. Definitely. Definitely. Yeah. Becca's awesome. <gasps> Watch the channel. Yep. Checks in the mail. Checks in the mail. <laughs> <laughs> All right, back in the pin event for the home stretch. We are in our final line for trading. We did not finish our tabs, but it's okay. These lines are long. Um, there we are. But but this is kind of like the the, the wrap up moment. They put away the pin previews. They're giving out the um, the goodbye set, which I'll show you right now. It's really pretty. So this pin set here is the uh, the parting gift for the event. So everybody that attended gets this when they leave. A four pin set. It's got Pegasus, Lady. Cricky, and then this is amazing. It's um, Buster from Toy Story. I think this is the only Buster pin that there is. So for now, all of us are all Buster completists, I guess. <laughs> um, but it looks, it's a really nice set. I like it a lot better than the uh, Pascal set. Yeah. There you have it. All right, I've escaped. <laughs> and the building is closing. It's the end of Fairy Tales 2019. <laughs> Disney pin trading event. It was really fun. Um, I am going to show you at the end of this video a little clip of the pins that I pulled off the boards because I it's been so chaotic and so loud that I haven't really been able to show, but I'll show you what I traded for. The boards were like kind of, they were kind of so-so this year. I got a couple good pulls and a couple things that I'm not that jazzed about, 
but um, it was a great event overall. I met so many wonderful people. I got great quality time with Ryan and with Yvette and with Sarah Beth and with Johnny and like everybody's been super fun. And I cannot wait till next year. So thank you so much for following along. If you have questions about Disney pin trading or this annual Disney pin trading event, please leave a comment down below. I will try to answer. And um, thanks so much for watching. This is like my first pin event focused video vlog. So it's been a little bit of an experiment. I hope it turns out and I hope that you find it helpful. Okay, so really quickly before I end this vlog, here is a look at the 10 pins that I pulled off the cast member uh, pin trading boards. This one here is probably my favorite. It's the Anna and Elsa Frozen. Gingerbread House from the Contemporary Resort. This is a 2014 pin and almost all of the pins that I pulled off are artist proof and you can tell by looking for the little AP stamp on the back of the pin. It just tells you that's an artist proof pin so they're kind of special high quality pins that are um, kind of set aside in the, the pin completion process by Disney specifically for this event. So I've got Simba. This is an open edition, but also an AP. I've got a 2015 Jungle Cruise pin. I guess Jingle Cruise from the holidays from 2015. This is also one of my favorite pulls. This is from the new wave of, I think, still unreleased Hidden Mickeys. It's Peter Pan's Flight pin. I'm a big fan of Peter Pan's Flight. I showed this one earlier. It's a Mary Poppins uh, Dapper Day Fine and Dandy pin, and that's also AP. Then I have two of the same pin from the Hong Kong part. It features um, Gelatoni from the Duffy and Friends uh, family of characters. Um, I don't know why I pulled off two. Actually, I do know why, because the second time I pulled it, it was covered by these little beads, and I couldn't tell which character was underneath, and I ended up with two of the same pin, but I was hoping to get two from, like, this same set of different characters. Oh, well. Still cute. I like Gelatoni. I'll have to give one of those away. Um, this pin here, my friend John pulled, and I traded him for one of my pulls because my mom collects Small World, and this is from one of the recent holiday sets. It's a little poodle there in that one. Super cute. I think this is the French, the France one. This is also from Hong Kong. I thought it was super cute for the holidays. It's Shelly Mae with a little cup of cocoa. And then finally I have um, from the Ralph Breaks the Internet Mystery set, the Jasmine pin with Vanellope. And I wonder if this one is also artist proof. Yep, there's the AP right there. So basically all of these pins um, are artist proof except for the uh, the Hong Kong ones. But those were my pulls. They're not amazing, but they are some nice pins. I'll probably keep most of them. And also, I did not get a chance to film the um, pin previews in my vlog, but my friend Ryan from Disney Pins Blog made an incredible video of all of this year's pin previews, which I will link down below. And speaking of Ryan. Hi, friend, here comes Ryan, he did it. Hey. I secured it. You got it. I secured it. Fairy Tales 2019. Oh my gosh, look at this. This is Ryan's yeah, like buddy. find of the of the weekend. Huge, beautiful WDI Splash Mountain Jumbo. Look yeah. at that glitter. I know, it's gorgeous. That is some glitter embellishment. Mm -hmm. Wow. LE 200. LE 200. That's what you get when you're the godfather of pins. That's right. Hey, Fairy Tales 2019 in the books. It's a wrap. We did it. That's it. High five. High five. High five. We tried to high five, but yeah. it's kind of awkward. But word is awkward. It's the godfather of pins, though. Did you have fun? I had a great time. You gonna be here next year? You better believe it. 20 years. <laughs> celebrating 20 years Disney celebrating pins. Disney pins. Yeah. It's like since it before fun. you were born. <laughs> <laughs> Not quite.